Okay. Anyway, uh, Sam Williamson is the um, director of the Federal Coordinator uh, for Meteorology. Uh, this is the office that, uh, at least for hurricanes, does all the coordination between uh, the multi-agencies that are involved in the Watch and Warning program. And he plays a big role in coordinating uh, both operations and the research community for hurricanes. So hurricane-related coordination activities, he annually hosts the IHC to educate attendees on the status and future plans of the nation's hurricane forecast and warning program. The IHC provides a forum for all the participating federal agencies. So uh, we're talking DOD, Air Force, uh, Navy, uh, the Army Corps of Engineers, FEMA, um, to review the nation's hurricane uh, forecast and warning program, and we make recommendations on how to improve the program in the future. So during the IHC, OFCM has sponsored um, the Working Group for Hurricane and Winter Storms Operations and Research. That uh, group meets and uh, reviews are submitted uh, in terms of the action items regarding uh, making changes to the national hurricane operations plan, and that's sort of the, the Bible for hurricane operations. Um, and that's published annually. Okay, there is also um, a publication that a number of us uh, has contributed to, and this is the Intra-Agency Strategic Research Plan for Tropical Cyclones, The Way Ahead, and it's a culmination of a working action item from the 2004 IHC. It was the underpinning of NOAA's HFIP program, the Hurricane Forecast Improvement Project, with a recommendation to monitor and update the operational priorities of the tropical cyclone forecast and warning centers, monitor and update research needs, and then develop the multi-agency research implementation strategy to address all the research needs. Uh, and so we formed a new working group for TC research to address recommendation two with the objectives to monitor and update the operational priorities of TC forecasts and warning centers. And that it culminated in one of the tables um, for, the, um, for the publication. And also we have a table uh, mapping out all of the research needs for the tropical cyclone program. And we, ma we map the agency meteorological TC research efforts against the TC research needs and the operational priorities. So this was an effort that uh, many of us started uh, several years ago. Um, I have some results um, from uh, that analysis. And um, probably can't read this, but this is table one of the publication. Uh, and it states the operational priorities of the operational hurricane center. So that's the National Hurricane Center, the Central Pacific Hurricane Center, and the Joint Typhoon Warning Center. And then um, on this diagram, I want to get rid of that. Uh, the operational priorities are linked to the research needs, which is in the right column here. And the research needs are in Table 2. And they're under, general, they're under the following topics. So we have general research topics in terms of intensity and structure changes. So there's basic and applied research uh, in terms of improving track. Also, uh, basic and applied um, activities, tropical cyclone formation, precip, coastal and inland inundation, and um, predictability of seasonal tropical cyclone activity. Then we have model development topics, which takes into account all the data simulation, the um, actual global and regional model developments, the relative importance of physical processes in these models, verification, diagnostic techniques, and development of ensembles and advanced probabilistic guidance. And then the third category was the observations and observing strategies to take into account OSSEs, um, information systems, and field programs. So anyway, this is, uh, this is an analysis of some of the uh, tropical cyclone R&D. It was a sna snapshot. So these pie charts are broken out uh, on the left-hand side in terms of um, different agencies that are, that, that are relevant to, to this. 
And so we have NOAA, NSF, the Navy, NASA. I'm not quite sure what was the other. MMS. MMS. Yeah, thanks, right. Okay, so um, this is an, in total man, we have 200. So when I was getting briefed on this publication, uh, on this pie chart, so this is 79 man years in NOAA. I was asking Sam, where, where are the 79 men in NOAA? I, I, I wanted to know, anyway. Um, sorry. Okay, the, the one on the right is combined man years versus the research category. And again, um, so it's the general topics I talked about in terms of the basic and applied activities for tropical cyclones, these are the modeling and then these are the observing. And then this is the TC R&D conducted in each of the research categories from table two. So this is uh, really kind of interesting in terms of what each agency is investing within these different topics, these different activities. So. Um, uh, again, here's the legend of the different agencies, and you should get a copy of this and, and look through that, but it really maps out nicely the different contributions and investments of the agencies to these problems. And then again, here they are mapped to Joint Typhoon Warning Center priorities, um, and then for the Hurricane Center and the Central Pacific Hurricane Center. <laughs> Um, the current research mostly aligned with operational priorities, the number one operational priority for the three uh, forecast and warning centers is intention, intensity change. The national effort focused on number one priority, 35% of research is going towards intensity and structure changes. Uh, there's little emphasis on forecaster aids and guidance on guidance. Um, perhaps we need to revisit that. Uh, further results of this report will be presented in Savannah next week at the IHC. And um, these are examples of recent uh, coordination activities relating to hurricanes. And um, that's it.